today we're having fries and a chimichanga. We're by the fire because it is so cold. So let's open up and see what we got. So we have a gorgeously beautiful chimichanga. As you can tell, our dishwasher is going. Look at those fries. Starving. And then I have some ranch for my fries, which I'm gonna put on later because I don't want my fries to get soggy. So today I was gonna order chicken tenders from this one place, but then said they were open at 10. They weren't open at 10. And I was just, man, it's disappointing. So I ordered fries and a chimichanga. <laughs> mm. Mm-hmm. It is so delicious. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. It is so good. Again, I'm sorry for the change, constant changing of lighting. There is a storm out and it is going from dark to light to dark. Mm -hmm. My goodness. <laughs> Oh my goodness. This is so good. Okay. So, and the rice is like good. It has like a not so much of a chew of it, but like a bounce which is great and the beans are very like not watery there just perfect this is one of my favorite parts I like putting the lettuce with the beans Today I got chicken. Mm hmm it's so good. I'm gonna try some of the guac. Mm-hmm. It's like a little tangy. And then it has like that nice light avocado flavor and at the same time like the consistency is like just what it needs to be <clears throat> so yeah i was gonna like i was saying i was gonna order chicken tenders today you know that might be good for a rainy day like a nice comfort food but, um, yeah, no, they weren't open, so it was disappointing. So, I usually check up sites of the places that, like, I order from beforehand. And it's just, you know, I said they were open at like 10, so I was gonna order at 10. 
and they were like, we don't open till 11. I was like, oh no, I can't wait that long to eat. Because <laughs> by the time I get there, it'd be 11.30. I'd just be like so hangry by then. It wouldn't even be safe to drive. I'm just kidding. <laughs> mm. This pico de gallo is just mm -hmm. it's a very light side to the meal in contrast to like the beans and the richness of the sour cream and cheese <clears throat> which is great I think Mexican food is like my top five favorite. I think right now my favorite is Korean food. I like South Korean food. It's like so good. There's not a lot of cheese in it. <laughs> so I don't have to take like all lactose pills. And all the flavor, usually all the meals are very healthy. And I love kimchi. It's just love of mine. Second, Italian food. I love Italian food mostly because I'm in love with garlic and when I make Italian food I usually it gives me a reason to use a lot of garlic lemon and all that fun stuff and plus I am Italian. Third I think it would probably be Mexican food because the area I grew up in is just there's so much authentic Mexican food and I love mulca jet. I probably botched that, but mulca jet is one of my favorite comfort foods. <laughs> I didn't order it today. I had no one to hold it in the car because you know it's a soup type thing. And you usually want it in the stone and you can't really take that to go. Greek food. I can't think of another one. Excuse me one moment, I am going to get another lactose pill for these fries. <laughs> I realized I wasn't recording that whole time. That is horrible. I've already started on the fries. That's just my luck though, you know. I am a chicken, I am not a pig. I value, I was talking about my cheat day. Today's cheat day. And like, I value having baby abs over, you know, having cheat day every day. <laughs> you know, you can tell I started on the fries already. Oh my gosh, but yeah, <laughs> there was this one time, um, <laughs> I made a joke, I oh, was partying, um, this guy was like, he was like, hey, you work out? I'm like, yeah, he's like a bigger guy, and do you? <laughs> no, I was big at abs as you do, and I'm like, <laughs> oh, we all have abs, some are just hidden under layers of should I say this or no? I was like, oh, wide eyed. He started laughing. <laughs> He's like, I was like, oh, it's okay. He got so scared. I was like, I don't want to offend you. It reminds me of like this quote from Dowton Abbey. I wish men were as considerate of our feelings as we are of theirs. <laughs> Especially back then. 
Mm, it is so good. Mm -hmm. This is definitely the best comfort food of all time. Super warmy. Let's see, let's get a good one. There. Mm. So good. <clears throat> yeah. I believe I was not recording the whole time. That miffs me off. That miffs me off. <laughs> I was doing so good too. <laughs> Yeah. I don't know if I talked about Apex already. If not, I'll just go show it again with Flash. <laughs> but I downloaded this game, Apex. Um, well, Legends. And it's supposed to be just like Overwatch. It has like healers and warrior characters. One that interests me a little looked like Tracer. Another was like a warrior and she also like that interests me to play that. I'm downloading it like right now. As we speak. So I think it'll be fun. You can't play it single player yet. You have to play it like three other people. And I think there's a battle royale mode. I've seen some gameplay. <laughs> but it should be interesting because I like Overwatch, <laughs> so it should be good. <laughs> It'll be massively buggy if it's just like Overwatch. <laughs> the Reaper right now is so overpowered. That's ridiculous. <laughs> He's so broken. Inside and out. <laughs> Mmm. Alright. This has been so good. Thanks for eating with me. And I will eat with you next time.